All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a view. Uh, so I'm going to start with the supplier parts database here. Uh, we've got suppliers, and we've got uh, our shipments here, and this is what our parts look like. Uh, but uh, let's create a view that will uh, do S matching SP. So if we uh, S matching SP is this is the same as this. So it's the attributes of S, uh, that's the projection, and we're uh, joining S with SP. So that would look something like, um, let's go to S, and we go, uh, that would be something like uh, select uh, all the attributes of S, so I'm going to do S dot asterisk, these are all the, uh, all the attributes of S, from S natural join SP so this is the um, this is the this has got to get rid of this okay so this is the um, uh, SQL expression to do S matching SP if we say go it's what it looks like the attributes of S uh, and what SP looks like um, uh, with respect to S, or the the um, the S's that match SP. <clears throat> All right, so uh, so that's the uh, that's this is the SQL expression. We want to create a view. Instead of creating a, a separate table like this, we're going to create a view, and a view it just stores the SQL uh, statement. And uh, whenever you click to look at the view, it it executes the SQL statement, and that's what it displays. So to create a view, you edit. You can start with the SQL statement. You just uh, confirmed for what you want to do, and in front of it, you can say create view, and then the name of the view, and I'm going to call it S matching SP. Uh, create that view as this statement. This statement here, and that's all I have to do. Let me. Uh, uh, click go and now our view is created if we go back to the database we see now we have this view here and uh, we can browse it and this is it it's just like this if we look at the structure we see it's similar to what S is and um, no this is the structure of S when we look at the brow, oh yes, that's right. Yeah, this is the um, the the. Um, it's it's the structure of S except for uh, there's no primary key. This is not this is not a primary key because there can be more than one of them. Okay, and uh, it, actually, if we go, um, let me let me uh, go here and refresh this PHP my admin. And we actually now see when we look at our thing here, we see that there's the views. We see the views over here. Now, um, to, to see what, to, to confirm that this is a, this is different than a table, if we look at a table and we try to export a table, we, it looks like this. U.S. text, export the table, looks like this. We have the create statement for the table and the inserts to fill the table. That's what an export for a table looks like. But if we look at an export for a view, we export. And let's just get the text. View is text. When we look at this, we see just this. Uh, this is basically it. So I'm going to copy this out and go to a text editor and paste it in here. And this is what we have. Uh, this sort of sets up defining, creating. This is the name of the view as, and this is the select statement. So it has translated our uh, our select s dot asterisk from s natural join sp. It's converted it to s dot s n o as s n o s dot s name as s name s dot s status as status and so on from 
and this is how it stores S natural join SP. We can confirm that this works. Copy. And I can go to SQL and do a paste. And here we go. And we see that it is, in fact, the same. So that is how you create a view. Thanks for watching.